Hey St. Mark's, it's Ashley. Um, I am going to be leading in day prayers today. So welcome as you join on. Please uh, say hi and feel free to uh, put any prayer requests that you have in the comments. And we are glad you're here. hope everybody's staying dry today. It's a nice rainy day outside, but we definitely needed the rain. It was getting a little steamy out there, so <laughs> I'm glad it's here. We'll get started here in about two minutes, so um, if you have anything that you would like us to pray for, please put it in the comments. Feel free to say hi. Um, we are glad that you're here. Hi, Karen. Hi, Patricia. Hi, Henry. Hi, Joan. We're going to get started here in just about one minute, so feel free to add any prayers that you have for the day, and um, we'll start with a little bit of silence, and then we'll get started. An order for service for noonday begins on page 103 of the Book of Common Prayer. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. We'll say Psalm 119. Your word is a lantern to my feet, and a light upon my path. I have sworn and am determined to keep your righteous judgments. I am deeply troubled. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept, O Lord, the willing tribute of my lips and teach me your judgments. My life is always in my hand, yet I do not forget your law. The wicked have set a trap for me, but I have not strayed from your commandments. Your decrees are my inheritance forever. Truly, they are the joy of my heart. I have applied my heart to fulfill your statutes forever and to the end. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The love of God has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit that has been given to us. Thanks be to God. Um, today, since it's rainy and kind of stormy, I thought for our meditation I would read um, a liturgy for the watching of storms from uh, Every Moment Holy. This is a great um, book of prayers for everyday things, whether it's making your morning coffee or changing diapers or um, going on a date or whatever it might be. There are all kinds of, of really lovely liturgies in here, and they have a second volume that's all about death and grieving and... Um, and hope. So uh, I definitely check it out. So this is a liturgy for the watching of storms. In every storm, there is a sermon playing out in parable across the canvas of sky, telling of the awesome power of one whose judgments are just, but whose mercies are thereby all the more scandalous and unexpected, and whose tender love for us is beyond comprehension. Praise be to God for his infinite mercies. Indeed, we praise you, O Lord, that having both might and right to crush whatever within us would assert itself against you, 
you instead crushed yourself and by that act offered us life, taking the brunt of such furious judgment into your own form, the shielding and shielding us forever from what our treason so rightly deserved. Thanks be to God for his unmerited grace. Now may these mighty winds, these lightning strikes, these crashing calls of thunder, these hard rains, by their fierce beauty, set us in awe, their witness rightly reminding us of that just verdict we will never have to face, the ferocity of these elements, an inverse testament to the affections of those whose strong love has now become our shield against the coming storm. Glory to God for his sheltering love, extended even to us. O Christ, who is our peace, cradle us now, even as you will cradle us at that final reckoning, calming every fear by your nearness, as we watch with wondering eyes this storm-told story of a great judgment and an even greater mercy. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I give to you, my own peace I leave with you. Regard not our sins, but the faith of your church, and give to us the peace and unity of that heavenly city, where with the Father and the Holy Spirit you live and reign now and forever. Amen. Today we pray for all those joining us for Noonday Prayer today and for their good health and well-being. We pray for Sharon, Brad, Lewis, and Bill. We pray Thanksgiving for the rain. We pray for all doctors and healthcare workers and first responders. We pray for the people of Afghanistan, the people of Haiti, for all of those dealing with wildfires in California and Greece and France. We pray for those things which are left unsaid. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thank you guys for joining me today. Um, I hope you stay dry and you enjoy your Thursday. And we will see you next time.